So many of you guys will have seen my last video where I stitched somebody that was saying that if you get a LinkedIn top voice, it's not even a top voice, it's like a collaborative top voice, that that's the difference between a $50,000 job and a $100,000 job. I think I am at the point with this platform when I see people like that getting thousands and thousands of likes, when I see people like the One Salting Group putting out terrible advice and terrible hacks, I'm at the point where I just am starting to feeling really, really bad for the job seeker community on this platform. It's like people who actually put out valuable content, like real content, people that when you go on their LinkedIn and you see that they're verified, that they've actually been in recruitment or HR, or they've actually had a real corporate job for more than three days, when those people's voices get suppressed in the name of quick hacks and tips from people who aren't qualified, I just start to feel really, really bad for the job seeker community on this platform. I feel bad for any of you that come across this content and genuinely think that it's good content, like you should be wasting your time doing the tips and the tricks that these guys are teaching. It's just really disappointing, and I think the thing which is really disappointing as well is that TikTok seems to promote this type of nonsense and it verifies people and it gives them credibility um, and it just kind of is, is a joke in my mind.